Good morning. You know, there's a, a benefit of uh, hiding. Uh, I can remember as kids, we used to play uh, that game hide and seek. And uh, many people would try to find the best place to hide. That if you were the last one, like you were the one that won the prize, like you, you could conceal yourself and, and hide so that nobody else could find you. Sometimes people were so hidden so well, we used to get to the place where I give up, where are you? And we would have to uh, just uh, succumb to the very being that uh, we couldn't find them. Well, I like the, the depth of the Word of God when it says in Psalm 119, Your word have I hidden in my heart that I might not sin against you. Your word have I hidden in my heart. You know, when I think of that, to be able to conceal the word so great, so powerfully in our hearts, that we would not sin against God. That means that it's in there deep, that uh, the devil can't find it, nobody else can find it, but we know where it is because we've hidden it so deep in our hearts that it's a strength to us, it's a powerhouse to us, that it's hidden deep in our heart, that uh, the real reason is that uh, we would not sin against God. So whenever a sin comes along, whenever a temptation comes along, whenever something comes our way that is trying to get us and sway us away from God, we've got that word hidden so deep in our heart that there it just jumps out and says, no, follow the word of God. You know, I love Psalm 119. It's a beautiful psalm. It's the longest psalm that there is in the book of Psalms, and it's probably the longest psalm in the whole chapter in the whole Bible. But uh, they, Psalm 119, they say practically every verse talks about the Word of God, the strength of the Word of God. It talks about the judgments, the precepts, the statutes, the, the Word. Uh, there's so many uh, wordings that can come around that very place of being the Word of God. And it's important to have the Word of God in our hearts. So when it, it says in Psalm 119, when the psalmist wrote this, Your word have I hidden in my heart for the sole reason that I might not sin against you, God, because I want to stay close to you and have that relationship with you. Isn't that a wonderful place to be in our lives? And as I go over to uh, uh, Psalm 32, verse 7, it, it says here, the, the psalmist David says, You are my hiding place. You shall preserve me from trouble. You shall surround me with songs of deliverance. Hallelujah. Are you glad today for the word of God? Are you glad that uh, God sings songs of deliverance over us and blesses us and touches us every day of our life when we're so tempted, when we're so tried and in this world filled with discouragement and fear right now, your word have I hidden in my heart. Wow, what a powerhouse. What a, a strength. It's a treasure. It's like every time you open up that treasure chest, there's the word of God, and it's helping us to not sin against our Heavenly Father. God bless you today. And get into the word of God. Hide it deep in your heart. Make it be your strength every day of your life. Amen. God bless you.